My mama, when I showed her what I wanted to do, she was like, don't you think that's going to be a little hard? And I said, go big or go home, sis. That's how you need to live your life. Go big or go home. I love you, mom. She wasn't doubting me. She never doubts me. She was just saying, like, don't, don't bite off two more than you can chew. I never do that, baby. Oh, wow. My lashes are sticking. I always rise to the occasion. <laughs> but, yeah, this is, like, Coachella vibes. She been on my mind. As soon as she get back, she gets slayed. I hate this lighting right now. It's making me look a bit dingy. But, <laughs> how y'all like? I snapped. Viral? Question mark? <laughs> um, yeah, so this color, this hair color, phenomen phenomenally. Is that a word? Mm -hmm. I did a great job. Love the curls, boo. Love the curls. Hey, sis. I really snapped. I'm really getting so good, and I'm so proud of myself. So I'm back with a video, and as you can see, it's something different. Something I've always wanted. I've always wanted rainbow hair, so I did that. Um, I got this wig from Hair Spills. Love it so much. It's an 18-inch, 130% density human hair blonde wig. That's all what I'm about. Uh, that name just makes sense. What am I talking about? <laughs> so as you can see, the texture of the hair is actually wavy. And yeah, this tutorial might seem, you might think that it's hard, but it actually wasn't hard at all. So what I started off by doing was splitting the hair down the middle. And on one side, I did purple faded into pink. And then the other side was like an orangish red faded into like yellow, I guess. So sorry, don't mind my phone. <laughs> And like I said, everyone always wants to text me when I'm doing a video. But, okay. Yeah, I just start by... I ended up t switching up my color and technique throughout the video. But, like, I started off by just putting the hair... I mean, the color right on the hair. But eventually, I began to mix the color with conditioner so it applied easier. But we'll get to that part when I get there. So, you just want to put the color on. Make sure you stop it halfway and drag it down you'll see what I'm talking about I kind of like brush the color down it's so hard to explain but like I'm doing like bring <laughs> I'm trying to explain it in the best way I can but I basically bring the color down and I added the pink on already but I'm gonna do this other side so you can see what I'm talking about I bring the color down and I like mix the other color with it at the same time so it like blends Wow, that was so hard for me to say. I'm such an idiot. But, yeah, I really like this, how vibrant of a color this is. I actually, I'm going to put all the colors down in the description, the ones that I used. Um, I got all of them from the beauty supply, and they all are semi-permanent dyes. So, they will eventually fade, but that's that's totally okay. Because I don't really wash my um hair as much as I, I feel like the regular person just because I don't wear it that much so I mean my wigs never really get dirty like that so it's 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 okay girl it's okay I do recommend that you do color in smaller sections just because you don't want it to be super splotchy and when you do color in bigger sections it might look like everything is colored but like when you wash it out baby the color is very splotchy so <laughs> I'm gonna tell you that you do need to color in smaller sections so that's why I'm um, coloring this half in smaller sections I mean I did the other half in smaller sections too but I didn't show that part but yeah and I'm just dragging it down dragging it down halfway this color looks so yummy and yeah I'm dragging it down and I begin to blend this is the second so this is the same color this red color but I just added some conditioner so now that we've diluted that color, we're just going to bring it down just a touch so it could be an even transition into the lighter, the lightest color that's at the bottom. So I like to smooth all the color down as much as I can. And it, you know, it naturally fades itself if that makes sense. So I ended up putting an orange at the bottom, but I diluted it again with some foamy conditioner. It's some Pantene foam conditioner. I actually show it to you in the video. For some reason, I feel like that really helps with, um, I mean, well, it is conditioner, but like the texture of it did help with diluting it better. So it kind of made, um, the bottoms of the, uh, what am I trying to say? The hair very like pastel in a sense. So super cute. I love, love, love the consistency of it. Like I'm such a weirdo. It's very satisfying <laughs> to say the least. Um, yeah, just put that all over the hair and I let it sit for maybe like 20 minutes like I didn't even let it sit for long just because I knew I really didn't need need for it to do that because the hair is already blonde so 
if you put this color on here, it, it basically colors instantaneously, to be honest. But yeah, I like, put all that color all over the hair. It looks so satisfying when you speed it up and watch it. It's so weird, bro. I love, love, love how this came out, though. I love it so much. Um, I kind of want to do a wig, um, like this red and orange side, just like the whole wig that color, because I really like how that came out. I like how the other side came out too, but I like how the how vibrant the colors are on the left. I mean, on the right better. So, this is how she looked before I washed everything out. Y'all do want to make sure y'all have a clean, crisp part because you don't want you know it to interfere with the color. So this is it washed and dried and she I think I did a pretty good job like this looks so good I'm so proud of myself so of course all the specs are gonna be down below do y'all like these kind of looks I like you know stepping outside the box cuz a lot of the times I'm doing like natural colors but like I'm an extra kind of gal um sorry people are texting me for once, I hate how this lighting is making me look and it's real dingy and dusty outside. So like, I can't even go outside to like give you the full effect. See next, they don't even have to be just about hair. Like what do y'all want to see in general? You got anything that you want to see me do, let me know. And then I always, um, if y'all see some kind of videos that's like outside the norm, um, that means I'm just testing it out to see what y'all like. So if you don't like it, don't go on me in the comments.